Hello everyone, Mauro here. In this lesson, we're going to look at the steps to upgrade from Windows 11 version 23H2 to version 24H2 the easy way through the Windows Update settings. Although Microsoft supports multiple ways to upgrade a computer, this is the easiest method. This process won't delete your files, settings, or apps, but it will reinstall the operating system. So it is still recommended to create a full backup before proceeding in case of something goes wrong. Also, if you don't see the option to upgrade, it's likely that your computer is still not fully compatible with the new version. So I would recommend not to try to force the upgrade on your computer. Okay, let's dive into the steps to upgrade to Windows 11 version 24H2. But before, please subscribe to the channel and click the like button to help YouTube show this video to more people. It doesn't cost anything and you will be helping the channel and supporting my work. First, open Start and look for Settings. Then go to Windows Update. And from here, if you're trying to upgrade during the early days, make sure to turn on this option and then click the Check for Updates button. Once you do that, you will see this option right here to upgrade to Windows version 24H2. And now simply click the Download and Install button. Now the Windows Update settings is going to download the installation files and proceed with the installation. You will then need to restart the computer to complete the upgrade to the new version of Windows 11. Now you just need to click the restart button for the upgrade to complete on your computer. And as you can see, the Windows Update settings also gives you an estimate on how long this process is going to take. Also, it is important to know that you won't have to go through the initial setup because you're doing an in-place upgrade. So after the process completes, the computer will start directly into the lock screen. And that's pretty much it. Now you have been upgraded to version 24H2. You can confirm that you're running the latest version of Windows 11 by opening Start and looking for Settings. And then we need to go to System and then About. And under Windows Specifications, confirm that the version is 24H2. Don't worry about the OS build number because that will be different depending on the time when you're actually upgrading to the new version of Windows. Another way that you can check that the version has been installed is by opening start and looking for run. And from here, we can type the win ver command and then click OK. And that will also confirm that you're running version 24H2 on your computer. Now, here's a tip. If you're trying to upgrade during the early days of the release for Windows 11 version 24H2, one thing that you can do is to enroll the computer into the Windows Insider program, more specifically into the release preview channel, and then you can upgrade through that process. Let me show you that really quick. Open Start and look for Settings go to Windows Update, then click on Windows Insider Program. And on this page, you just need to click the Get Started button and link your Microsoft account so you can enroll your computer into the release period channel. Then after you restart the computer, go to Windows Update, click the Check for Updates button. Make sure you have this option turned on and then download version 24H2. After the upgrade has been completed, open the Windows Insider Program settings again. And then from the Stop Getting Preview Builds settings, make sure to check the Unroll button. And then the computer will gratefully opt out of the program and you will be able to keep the newer version of the operating system and it will continue to receive updates. And that's it. That is the easiest way that you can use to upgrade your computer to version 24H2. Remember to like the video, leave your comments, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done that yet. And I just hope this video was informative for you and I would like to thank you for viewing.